What's good, guys? Let's talk about Apple because they had a really, really good day at 4.33%. And a lot of people are asking if I think it's going to continue to run. So the first thing that you're going to see here is that there are multiple bullish setups that we have on our harmonic indicator right now. So we've been talking about this in our private academy for the past couple of weeks, and I still have some Apple calls set up. And what these harmonic patterns are looking for, which you can see they are very accurate, 67% on the, and 81% on the bottom left side of your screen. But what they're really looking for is not the absolute bottom, but it's looking to time a downward pulse, as you guys can see here. And it's not looking to come back up and make a higher high and to make a full reversal, but it's looking for that natural market cadence and natural market tendency where we will come back to tap and test these targets before in most cases making a lower low. So the way that I used to trade harmonic patterns was actually allowing the pattern to play out and then looking to go short and take my profits at a lower low. This is a really good way to trade and we do teach this within our private academy. But the other way that we teach is to actually play with these. So letting this continue to sell off. And then as you can see, once we're trading around this mid level, we know that there's at least a 67% chance that we're going to see this push back up. So now that this push has come back, there's a very high chance that we are going to most likely tomorrow reject at this level and pull its way back down. So I don't have puts on Apple, but if you are somebody who is in Apple and you are somebody who's, who's looking to play the Apple upside, what we really need here is a rejection and then actually a test back of 171 to see if we can get that move back up. Because last time this was very short lived as well. So at this point, I still have some calls in Apple. I do think short term, we're probably going to end up rejecting tomorrow, but I decided to hold them just because I feel that if we do blow through this top that we could start to move back up to 186. But like I said, just being authentic and honest, I think we're probably going to reject. If you want to trade with me every day, get access to my step-by-step -step systems on all of my strategies, all of our private indicators, and all of my trades in real time. Check out the link in the description to join the private academy. And I'll see you guys next time.